My name is Kenny and welcome to Abundant Acres. And today is the day we're gonna trim trees. But first of all, I'm gonna get my tree pruning expert over here with me. So, tree pruning ex <laughs> Boo. Hi. Boo's gonna help trim trees today. Last year we got a bunch of peaches. Well, I shouldn't say a bunch. We got some peaches, we got some apples. And Angie pruned these last year. And today we're going to double down because today we're going to prune them way back. And don't tell Angie. If you see her coming, let the both of us know because I'm going to cut this sucker way back. So enjoy the ride. Boo's going to help video. She's going to help prune. So we're going to try to make it like an hourglass shape. But these big, big branches at the top, they're going. So, and hopefully we don't get caught before we get done. Well, because I'm otherwise, be in the bone, but you'll probably be trying to see that. I'm not going to tell you. Well, I'm, going to be I'm just telling you right now, she comes out here while we're cutting that up. Uh, it's I, your fault. No, I'm running. <laughs> oh, no, you're not running because it's going to be totally your fault. Mm -hmm. I'll say, I, I tried to tell her. I tried to tell her, Grammy, she would not listen to me. That's how this is going to go down. So. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to tell Grammy after this, if you don't mind. <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> anyway, everybody stay tuned. Like I said, we're going to make an hourglass, and we're going to cut it way back. And if I come up missing, somebody call somebody or come look for me or something. Because once she sees this, we both may be in trouble. I ain't going to be in trouble. We're probably going to be hiding in the kitchen house with be careful! Did that? Because I think Grammy's going to We're not telling Grammy. No. She'll just think, oh, we burned them way back last year. That way. Nope, not that way. This way. Well, wait. <laughs> this way. Come this way. You got it. You got her whip now. All right. Ready? You grab that side. I got this side. Ready? They got you. So we took out the one big one. Now we're gonna take out this one. Okay. And wait, taking out the big one. Wish us luck. Will they go back? I hope so. If not, if it don't grow back, you're in trouble. I am the one that's in trouble. Hey, stay protected. Well, these. Stay protected. Safety first. Yeah, we get rid of the evidence. Yeah. We'll leave that there. That way, if we need to chip it up, we can chip it up for the chicken to make molts out of it. I ain't doing it. I can't be arrested because from Grammy because you're the one that did it. I just filmed you. Okay, maybe I would do it. Wait a minute. Are you trying to say you're going to leave Pop all hang out to dry on this? Okay, so what we're going to do here is we're going to make a little arborist. Nope, not that one. There's a method to it. See where these start going up and out? You need to cut it off oh, so right about there. Hold on just a minute. Yep, open it up. Come on. You got to make a grunt noise. Uh, I'm helping you. Uh, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, and it's okay even if you make a little fart sound every once in a while. <laughs> Side and I'll get this side. Ready to go. I did it. What? You didn't yell timber. 
Kimbo! There we go. First reaction, Boo, what do you think of the tree that you cut? It's good. So you did a good job cutting the tree. I did not cut the tree, you did. All right. I'm going to say trimming trees with a 10-year-old is like herding cats using a skunk. So, but we're going to keep on moving. On to the next one. Oh. Okay, I lost my help, uh, but as you can see, how overgrown all this is, and we just let it continue to grow and do what it wants to do, the tree's just gonna be huge. So, like I said earlier, we're gonna try to double down, try to trim this thing way back, and see if we can't get some big, healthy peaches. Uh, I don't know how many quarts we put up, but I mean, I, I would say that we got enough for um, Angie and I, but not enough to just keep sharing the abundance. So that's what we like doing. We like sharing the abundance. So we're going to try to trim these way back and be more fruitful. We can keep our tree manageable, small, and don't have to use a 10 or 12 foot ladder. We we'll want to keep that like wine glass uh, shape. Ooh, got me. Okay, obviously that's what I'm gonna do. And uh, that's what we already have done. So we're just gonna keep on progressing and keep on moving forward. I know it still needs a little bit more fine tuning, but I'm not gonna fine tune, so I'll have Angie do the fine tuning. 